All right, we are going to talk about a common denominator. What is the common denominator for outward issues? The skin, the hair, lack of, hot spots, bleeding gums, brittle nails, eye discharge in the eyes, the yeast in the ears, the horrendous digestion, right? The, the diarrhea or the up and down, the non-consistency of the stools. Again, issues with the skin in between the paws, a dry, uh, flaky skin, aches, pains, jacked up joints, brittle bones. If you ever, God forbid, you ever get to that point, that's a major level. Tiredness, lethargic, no energy, all those issues. What's the common denominator? Inflammation. At the end of the day, inflammation is the common denominator for all ailments. Inflammation. Where does inflammation come from? Lack of nutrients. The more on point your nutrition is for your canines, the less likelihood of inflammation setting in. Now, let's go deeper on that. Inflammation is the epicenter. What happens when inflammation is out of control for a period of time? It creates compound interest to let in disease. You name it. It's going to map back to the starting point of inflammation. Then that's going to map back to, right? Because we like to reverse engineer, reverse engineer here at Canine Super Supplements. So now backtrack. Disease. Outward and internal issues. Inflammation. Where's home base? Nutrition. Or lack of. You just follow the orange arrows and then backtrack with those orange arrows every single time inflammation to disease then when we go past when we take that next step into disease now that opens that up to chronic and potentially fatal issues right including cancers inflammation it starts as inflammation then becomes a disease and then potentially a seaworm that's how simple this game is. That's why nutrition, that's why the, the cleaner the fuel, the smoother the ride, just a fact. And that's why it's so important to look at this as compound interest and to be aware, right? The level of awareness is, is huge. Again, you know, I talked about this before, but there's plenty of people out there that believe their breed, whether it's a Frenchie, English Bulldog, a Pit Bull, uh, a Bull Mastiff, a Boar Bull, I don't, there's people out there that believe their breed is expected to have gas. Here's what I mean. You, you, you've all heard it. Oh, man. My English Bulldog, he just blows us right out of the room. You know how they are. You know how the English Bulldogs are. You know how the Frenchies are. they constantly blowing us out of the room, right? I came and stay in the room. I get the whole house stinking. Uh, oh, man. You know how the Mastiffs are. They're known for that. It's not about the breed. It's about what they're consuming and what their bodies are rejecting. It's your car backfiring. It's not good, right? Obviously diarrhea is not good, but it all maps back to infl inflation, inflammation. It all maps back to inflammation, right? There's something going sideways and you are getting all these outward signs. You got to That's where you got to reconnect with your primal DNA to start to identify this is not normal. It's This is a living being. They should not have gas all the time blowing people out of the room. They should not have diarrhea on a consistent basis. They shouldn't feel uh, tired and lethargic on a consistent basis. They shouldn't have jacked up joints on a consistent basis. None of this should be chronic. Every once in a while, they eat something, and their body's rejecting it, fighting it, okay, now they're blowing it out. Okay, that happens, that's called life. But chronically, mm -mm. you gotta look at the nutrition. You gotta look at the animal protein, animal fats. And then when you're feeding the kibble, you gotta start filling in those gaps. Animal protein, animal fat, and some other things that you know will help. That's it, again, again, it sounds so simple, doesn't it? Because it is. Mother nature made sure that us humans could figure this out. We just got to take the time and surround ourselves with the right people and the right resources. That's all this is. 
And it's your obligation, my obligation. The dogs didn't ask to come to you or me. We brought them in. That's our obligation. This is our job. We need to we need to take the helm here. We signed up for this. They didn't. They just happened to be the most unconditional uh, living beings on the planet. That's all. So guys, inflammation, the epicenter. You get that inflammation under control, everything's gonna start to fall into place. If you ignore that inflammation, it's gonna just spin out of control. So guys, do me a favor. If, if you're getting value out of this, and I know you are, share, like, comment, whatever. Let's, let's get this uh, uh, channel blown up because we're just coming at you real. We keep it real rolling live, and you know my MO. You're gonna leave with more information and you came in with whether you like it or not. That's just the way we roll here. So guys, uh, we've been having a lot of great interaction with people. The channel's starting to really pick up. So appreciate you guys. Canine Super Supplements, right? All of our products can stand alone or stack together as a combo. So hit me up, any questions, but you've got to start filling in those nutritional gaps and you can't get any more cost effective and convenient than Canine Super Supplements. We did this on purpose. This business plan was done on purpose. So, guys, appreciate you.